shit. Really glad that you're going home. Yeah. Yeah. Best news I've heard in weeks. Yeah. Hell perfect. of a guy. All Hell right. of a guy. Thanks, guys. I mean, it really means a lot, you know? On the afternoon of January 3rd, most of E Company headed back to our old position in the woods overlooking Foy. A few men remained in the Bois Jack attached to D Company to hold the main line of resistance. Good luck, ladies. Well, nice knowing you. Wouldn't drink too much if I were you. Hey, be careful if he offers you a cigarette. What are they talking about? <laughs> if who offers us a cigarette? Spears. Who? Lieutenant Spears. Lieutenant Ronald Spears was one of the platoon leaders in D Company. He was already a legend. The stories about Spears are probably all bullshit anyway. What stories? <laughs> what stories? Well, supposedly Spears shot one of his own men for being drunk. You're kidding. That's unbelievable. Yeah. And there's another one about him giving cigarettes to 20 German POWs before killing him. He shot 20 POWs? Well, actually, I heard it was more like 30. Christensen. Lieutenant Spears. I got the name right, didn't I, Christensen? Yes, sir. What are you men doing out here? We were watching the line, sir. You keep up the good work. While you're at it, you might want to reinforce your cover. Oh, well, actually, sir, Lieutenant Dykes are not even to bother. They're only going to be here one day. Lieutenant Dykes said that, huh? I don't forget what I said. Carry on. Oh, anyone care for smoke? You? <laughs> 